We use carbon fiber everywhere in the yacht, from the top of the mast to the bottom of the foils. I mean, there's carbon fiber in the sails, there's carbon fiber in the hull, obviously, uh, in the foil arms, in the rudder, everywhere. So carbon fiber main benefit is its weight to strength and weight to stiffness ratio. There's other added benefit to carbon fiber. If you look at a piece of metal, for example, it has the exact same properties in all directions. Carbon fiber is a very fine fiber. You can orient it towards the strengths you require within a component. Tailor the orientation of the fiber towards the load you want it to withstand. INEOS has been a major contributor to the manufacturing of the carbon fiber, which is everywhere in, in the yacht. 100% of the hull is made out of Torre carbon fiber. The full arm as well, which was built by Persico for all the team, they all made out of Torre carbon fiber. At the end of last America's Cup cycle, Tim Newsom and Richard to all the teams to bring everybody together towards a sustainability goal for this America's Cup. So we were involved in the writing of the rule as some suggestion made to, let's say, within the build of the boat, bring some sustainability um, element to it. Uh, there is a series of eight choices we have to make to bring some sustainability aspect. Every team has to choose two of them. We chose making an LC analysis of the build of the yachts from starting making the mold to the boat reaching the race course here in, in Auckland. And the other one is we've intensively used recycled carbon fiber in the manufacturing of the yacht. So we partner with a company called ELG. They recycled all our AC35 carbon fiber waste, and we use that waste to make the mold of Britannia. Anything we can do to bring a circular economy to what we do, it's important, and it's important also to give a, a number to whatever choices we made in terms of manufacturing and choices of materials. It's a very, very important product.